I'm going to show you an example of a project profile. When you open the profile and click on the arrow on the right side of the screen, you will open up a section where you have several options. You can translate the project profile into different languages. You can edit project alert settings, add the project profile to Outlook or Google Calendar to set up, for example, a reminder around important dates like tenders, contract awards, etc. And the last option is My Notes, where you can leave a note. It can be public, which means all users from your company will be able to see it, or private, in which case the note will be visible only to you. If you go to My Account and Manage Notes, you'll find all public notes left by you and other registered users from your company. When you scroll down, you'll find the project's location and the latest photos of the project site. You can find more details on the project in the description and the scope section. And right below, you'll reach companies and contacts, where you'll find a list of companies involved in the project. The list is based on the company role, and there are three columns for information on pre-qualified, bidding, and awarded companies. In this example, in the second column, bidders, we can see the list of main contractors that bid for the project, and in the third column, we can see who got awarded the contract. In this case, it's a joint venture of two companies. In News and Updates section, you can read the latest updates on the project provided by our research team. In case you have any questions about the content on the project profile page, you can always use Contact Researcher tool at the top of the page under the project's name. This tool allows you to reach out to our team of researchers and ask different questions related to the profile's content. You can request for additional contact numbers, get project status updates, etc. Just select the topic and submit the query. The query is then sent to the team and forwarded to your account manager as well. You can monitor the queries you submitted by clicking on My Account and track Contact Researcher. Here you'll find a list of queries you've sent. You can see questions you asked and check the status of each query.